when many years ago in the 80s we learned about SFT here in Finland, we immediately thought that the ideas are worth spreading, not only to colleagues in the field of therapy, but to the population at large, to coaches, managers, teachers, doctors, nurses, politicians, parents. But we were divided. Should we start a long and draining fight against the system to get SFT approved as a full-bodied therapy model, or should we focus on making the ideas available to everyone? We have tried to do both. On one hand, we have struggled to get SFT approved in Finland. We have been successful, some would say, but the fight has been far from fun. I don't even feel like reminiscing about the senseless battles that we have fought over the years with representatives of old-school psychotherapy. Psychotherapy is such a weird field. Fashions come and go and you never know what's the evidence-based therapy of the year. Politics and relationships seem to play a much bigger role in the world of psychotherapy than any of the best interests of the clients. On the other hand, we have also worked in spreading SFT principles to the people. Together with Tapani Ahola, we have designed a few practical protocols to help spread SF ideas. We have created reteaming and cooperation for working with organizations and kid skills, mission possible and steps of responsibility for working with children and young people. These are not new methods. They are simply repackaged applications of SFT intended to help us make SFT easier and more accessible to people who may not be interested in acquiring training in SFT. I'm not sure what will happen with SFT in the future, but I'm afraid that many of the simple yet so powerful ideas of SFT will be abducted by other players in the field of psychology and coaching who will rename them, wrap them in a new wrapping and present them as their own unique inventions without ever giving any credit to Milton Erickson or any of the other pioneers of SFT. When we get old, we can then get together and lament and complain that this is exactly what we have tried to say all these years. But until then, let's hang in there. Let's continue to make SFT known around the world and help people understand that many ideas that are currently becoming so popular around the world, such as how to focus on clients' goals and how to utilize clients' own resources, have been described years ago in detail within the SFT movement. I cannot avoid thinking that as a culture we are but reinventing the wheel. It may appear that there are many new magicians out there pulling different rabbits out of their hats, but with a closer look we may find that even if the magicians change, the rabbit is always the same. <laughs>